To perform this work, you will safely need to remove the calipers from the car. Please follow the link provided at the end of this video for additional assistance with that task. Once you have the calipers on your bench and hopefully had a chance to soak them in parts cleaner overnight, you can remove the outer seal by simply prying it out from the caliper housing. The new seals are installed in reverse fashion, but may require some finesse work to get them properly seated in the grooves. The best method I've found for removing the caliper pistons is to use compressed air to blow them out. Beware though, start with low pressure and then increase it if it's not enough. It's easier than you might think to send your pistons flying across the room. So be careful with the pressure. Make sure that you replace the inner piston seal. This seal is what keeps the brake fluid from leaking out past the cylinder. Also, be sure that you clean the entire inner cylinder for dirt, debris, and corrosion. Don't scratch the inside of the caliper cylinder while you're working on it, or you may have problems with the caliper leaking when you reassemble it. Thanks for watching. Be sure to subscribe to our channel and check out another video in this series.